A Dearborn Heights woman says that she feels as if she lost a family member. A few days ago, the neighbor's pit bulls got loose and jumped into her yard, killing her beloved dog. Sean Lay spoke with her today as she fears something worse could happen if those dogs are allowed to go back home. I mean, a yeah. pet, that was my child. That was my baby. Julaine Mills loved her dog Juicy like you love your pet. What happened first thing this past Saturday morning, she will never get out of her mind. Screams from her son, then screams from her beloved dog Juicy. What did you see? So, my son heard the commotion of the dog Sparky, but my son actually seen the other dog jump, like jump and they grabbed her, both of them had her. And he was just screaming at the top of his lungs like, help, help, somebody help mom. It happened right here on Edgewood in Dearborn Heights. The police report reads, two pit bulls were running loose, running from their home down the block, over the Mills family fenced in backyard, and both attacked Juicy. Juicy did not survive. You can see the marks on the back door where Juicy was frantically trying to get away from the dogs that were attacking her. That could have been a person. That could have been anybody that when them dogs got out that got out that lady house that day and what they did to my dog, that could have been my son, that could have been anybody. We are live tonight. You really feel for the owner of Juicy right there. We've been working this story all day long. We just made contact with the owner of those two pit bulls. She did not want to talk about this incident. She did, however, receive two tickets for having a vicious animal running loose. The dogs were seized. We also caught up with Dearborn Heights. The city of Dearborn Heights says that both dogs are with animal control being held as evidence right now. Depending on what happens in court, uh, when this goes to court, guys, those dogs could be put down. Back to you. This stuff. Horrible. Really.